Hi, welcome back to Careers Portal and we are here at Faults Bay Westlake campus and we're speaking to the Head of Engineering, Saluami. At which campuses of Faults Bay College are the NCV Engineering programs offered? Well, the NCV Engineering programs are actually offered at two of our campuses. It's at the Westlake campus, which is situated near um, Okaap Sevach, and then also at our Kailicha campus. The programs within the NCV um, courses are electrical engineering or mechanical engineering, and in mechanical we also offer fitting and turning, welding and motor mechanics. And what are the entry requirements and what type of learner is best suited for the NCV programs? The minimum requirement for a NCV level 2 is a grade 9 certificate with a pass in mathematics because grade 9 is on the NQF level 1. Our NCV programs start at NCV level 2 which is equivalent to an NQF level 2. Um, the students that are best suited will be the students that are actually sure of what they want to become, students who know what their interests are. Um, so we are actually looking because the world is acknowledging that traditional schooling is not necessarily the only way of becoming an artisan or becoming qualified. So if a student knows from a very early age what his interests are, the NCV program is actually perfectly suited for that student because we will assist the student to, um, to become qualified in his field of interest. He can become an entrepreneur. We do have a center for entrepreneurship on the Westlake campus or he can further his studies in a, at a tertiary institution. Institution. And how do the NCV programs equate to the grades offered at school and what is the duration of the NCV programs? The total duration of the NCV program is three years um, and the NCV level 2 is more or less equivalent to a grade 10 with NCV level 3 being equivalent to a grade 11 and NCV level 4 which is the exit level being equivalent to a NSC or a matric certificate. Um, one of the distinguishing factors of the NCV program is that the students, the vocational subjects, each vocational subject is actually allocated workshop periods. So the students will be issued with a PPE, personal protective equipment, which includes an overall and a pair of safety boots. And the students will engage in workshop related activities right from the start of the program at NCV level two. What are the career opportunities for these students for a learner with an NCV qualification? On completion of a NCV level 4, a student can go to work um, for 18 to 24 months um, at an industry of his choice in his field of studies. Um, and then afterwards, he can apply for um, a trade test. So when he's successful in the trade test, he'll be a Red Seal um, a qualified artisan. So he'll either be an electrician, a motor mechanic, a welder, or a fitter and turner. And then it's up to the student if he wants to continue his studies, if he wants to start his own business, or if he would like to work in the sector of his choice. How does a learner apply for an NCV and are there bursary opportunities? A student will have to access the False Way College website and he'll have to upload supporting documents which includes a certified copy of his ID, proof of address and then also higher school certificates. Um, we do have a bursary office. Students will also have to apply for the NISFAS bursary online. If they do experience challenges, the bursary office may be uh, contacted and they will be able to assist the students. Thank you so much, Salome, for coming in. We really appreciate this, and I'm sure our viewers did too. Thank you, Shakira. It was a pleasure. Thank you. <laughs>